All right, as well this afternoon, I'm going to prove to you that 0 equals 1. Believe it or not. Um, and I'm going to do this by using a series. A series is the sum of a sequence. Yesterday we did the Fibonacci sequence. If you add up all those numbers, that's called the Fibonacci series. So this will be a good introduction to what we're doing today. So proof. Left side is equal to 0, which is equal to 0 plus 0 plus 0 plus 0 plus 0, etc. Right? You agree with that? Mm -hmm. Okay. But every 0 on the right-hand side is 1 minus 1. So 1 minus 1 plus 1 minus 1 plus 1 minus 1 plus 1 minus 1. It doesn't matter how many I write here, but I guess I've got six of them. So is that six? It doesn't matter. Now, in other words, if you group these two, that's 0, that's 0, that's 0, that's 0. So I guess I'm a short one, but it doesn't matter. That's true. But I don't need those brackets, as I just said. And I can group those numbers differently. So I can group, for example, the second and the third ones. So it's 1 plus minus 1 plus 1 plus, if I group these two, minus 1 plus 1 plus minus 1 plus 1 forever and ever. Amen. So just keep going. But what's that equal to? If I do that up here, I get 1 plus 0 plus 0 plus 0 plus 0 plus a bunch of zeros. And we know that the zeros add up to zero, so that's equal to one. <laughs> QED, big fat check mark, or better yet, smiley face. <laughs> now you know that zero equals one. Right? It's gotta no. be, I just proved it. No. No? What's wrong? If there's always a like extra negative one. Yeah. Well there's always an extra negative one, negative one, plus one, plus one, to infinity. There's an infinite number of numbers. So it's not just an extra negative one. It goes forever, and they're all equal to zero. If it goes to infinity, then plus yeah. one is going to be canceled. It's all, they're all zeros. <laughs> infinity. The problem with infinity is all sorts of weird things happen when you're dealing with infinity. So looks like zero equals one. No, I, th I think what you did was infinity plus one there. Infinity plus one? Can you do that? Well, infinity plus one is infinity, but I don't have infinity plus one. I have a bunch of zeros plus one. <laughs> Infinite zeros plus one. Infinite zeros is still zero. Think about it. Okay, one more proof. It's just, you stopped it, right? Oh, uh, 